alegria. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Good morning, Lord. Good morning, Lord. We want to praise you. We want to thank you today. We want to worship you, Lord. We thank you, Lord, and we praise you, Lord, for the joy, for the honor, for the privilege, for the pleasure, Lord, to be able to worship you and to adore you today. Thank you, Lord Jesus, that we're your children. Thank you, Lord Jesus, that we can call you Father. Thank you, Lord Jesus, that we can praise your name. We thank and we praise you, Lord. We thank and we praise you, Lord. 
Today we want to <coughs> greet and say good morning to everybody who's taking part with, in this adoration with us. Thank you for coming to worship the Lord with us. Father James feels somewhat especially for Father James. Lord Jesus, we thank you, Lord, and we praise you, Lord, for the sign and the grace that you have given us, your children and your church and Father James. We pray, Lord, that you strengthen his body, that you strengthen his soul, that you strengthen his his heart, his soul, for the sins of the church. We thank you and we, and we praise you, Jesus. We pray, Lord, that you heal him and that you strengthen him, Lord. We pray to you, O oh Lord. Lord, hear my prayer. Lord Jesus, we have just woken up, and today is a new day. We want to thank you and praise you, Lord, for, for this new day. We want to make the firm decision, Lord, to live this day together with you and to set aside everything and anything that may separate us from you. We look into our hearts, Lord. There are many ideas, there are many notions, many emotions, many concepts, many bad negative feelings, Lord that are separating us from who you are. In this moment, Lord, in sincere repentance of the heart, we want to bring to you our defects, Lord, and our weaknesses, Lord. Lord Jesus, We bring to you our sinful attitudes. <clears throat> Maybe our sinful attitudes that are well in our exterior world. Maybe they're compulsive habits. Maybe they... <clears throat> it's the habit to get angry and to shout at other people to get angry with yourself. Maybe it's, it's the habit, it's, it's the custom of humiliating other people. And you can only feel good when you humiliate other people. Maybe it's the desire to insult others. <clears throat> Lord Jesus, maybe it's hating or despising other people and rejecting them and their love for you. Look into your bad habits, look into your bad attitudes. Maybe it's hatred and rejection, silent hatred, silent rejection in your heart. Or are you overeating yourself? Are you eating too much chocolate? Are you eating unhealthy things. Are you destroying the temple of your body through smoking? Are you destroying your mind and your heart through masturbation or maybe watching violent films and immoral seriousness on television? All of these things can separate you from the Lord. Maybe it's occult practices. Make the firm decision to leave this behind you. <clears throat> Lord, we bring to you these are sins, our negative attitudes. When we judge each other, when we refuse to reconcile with each other, with our neighbor, with ourselves. Maybe your greatest sin is self-righteousness. And you think yourself to be great because of what you do. Or you think yourself to be great 
because of your position in the church or your position in a family, your position in an institution <clears throat> or in a company. Bring your pride to the Lord. Bring your vanity to, it, to the Lord. Do you think yourself to be better than others? Do you consider others to be worse and bad? Well, you yourself are good. Is it your pride? <clears throat> With sincere repentance and with love to Jesus, with the longing to get closer to Jesus and the firm decision not to commit these sins again, to banish them from your heart, from your life, from your body, from your mind. Ask the Lord pardon. Change my heart, oh Lord. Make it up of you. Change my heart, oh Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We thank you, Lord Jesus. We worship you, Lord. We praise you, Jesus. Mighty you are, Lord. Holy you are, Lord. Hallelujah. Right now, we bring ourselves to you, Lord. <clears throat> We read Isaiah chapter 42, verses 1 to 7. 
Here is my servant, whom I uphold, my chosen one with whom I am pleased. Upon him I have put my spirit. <clears throat> he shall bring forth justice to the nations. He will not cry out, nor shout, nor make his voice heard on the street. A bruised reed he will not break, and a dimly burning wick he will not quench. He will faithfully bring forth justice. He will not grow dim or be bruised, and though he establishes justice on the earth, the coastlands will wait for his teaching. Thus says the Lord who created the heavens and stretched them out, who spread up the earth and its produce, who gives breath to its people and spirit to those who walk on it. I, the Lord, have called you for justice. I have grasped by the hand I formed you and set you as a covenant for the people, a light for the nations, to open the eyes of the blind, to bring up prisoners from confinement and from the dungeon, those who live in darkness. We thank and we praise you, Lord Jesus. Yes, Lord. We want to be like your servant, Jesus. We don't want to shout, cry out loud. We don't want to break the weak. We don't want to <clears throat> break the oppressed. Lord, we want to bring light to the blind. We want to bring freedom to the captive. We want to bring your grace, Lord, to the nations, Lord. Lord, empower us today, Lord. Make our lives, our bodies, our minds new today, that today we may be able to live like Jesus, that today we may be able to walk and talk and think and feel like Jesus. Yes, Lord, your son is the only hope we have. Lord Jesus, you're the only hope that we have. You're the only hope that we have of, of making things right in this crooked world. You're the only hope that we have of, of bringing healing, true healing in this corona crisis. You're the only hope that we have, Lord Jesus, of bringing recovery, truthful recovery to the economy, Lord. You're the only hope, Lord, that we have of living a life without fear. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for taking the cross for us. Thank you, Lord, for shedding your blood for us. Thank you, Lord, for all the suffering that you endured for us, for all the <clears throat> physical and mental and spiritual suffering that you had to go through on our behalf, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Lord, thank you, that, Lord. that you took the darkness that we may be able to, you, to be free, Lord Praise Jesus. Thank you, Lord. thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Hallelujah.
Thank you, Lord Jesus. Praise you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Look to the body of Christ. There, in the Holy Eucharist, Jesus is there as the crucified one. There in the Holy Eucharist, Jesus is there as the risen one. The fullness of the Paschal Mystery, the fullness of the message of Easter, of the Gospel, and realities of Easter, of the passion, the death, and the resurrection of Jesus, the full life of Jesus is there in the Holy Eucharist. As you see to his body, <clears throat> See how blood comes forth from his body. The holy, sacred blood of the Lamb. Washing you clean. See how the blood of Jesus flows through your head, through your hair, through your brain. through your bones, through your eyes and ears, through your mouth and nose. The blood of Jesus is washing your head completely clean, clean of all temptations, clean of all weaknesses, lungs, <clears throat> through your heart. Through your upper arms, elbows, and lower arms, the blood of Jesus flows through your hands. The blood of Jesus is flowing through you now. This is the blood that he shed for you on the cross. This is the blood with which he saved humanity from sin, Satan, from hell, from diseases, and from all curses. This is the blood of victory that is flowing through your body right now, through all your organs. It's flowing through your diseases. You can feel now how the healing power of Jesus comes and it's like a fire flowing through all your sick organs. Patients. Maybe you feel the presence of a an infection of the throat or an infection of the lungs. The blood of Jesus is flowing through that infection right now. Maybe it's corona. Maybe you don't know what it is. Have no fear. All diseases are the same before the blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus washes all diseases away. <clears throat> If it's a cold, if it's a cancer, the blood of Jesus is washing it away right now. Tremendous is the power of the blood of Jesus. There is no greater power. You feel the blood of Jesus flowing through your stomach, through your intestines, through your kidneys. The blood of Jesus is flowing through your pelvis. Yes, this is the blood with which he took away all of our pains, all of our sins, all your pains are being washed away now by the blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus is flowing through your legs, through your knees, through your lower legs, through your calves, through your ankles and your feet. It's breaking every chain, breaking every bondage. It's healing, crushing every disease. The blood of Jesus is the most powerful disinfectant on planet Earth. Throughout creation, there's no more powerful disinfectant 
Amen. than the blood of Jesus. It is disinfecting your body. Your body sterile now through the blood of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Praise you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Right now, as the blood of Jesus flows through your body, see how the blood of Jesus is flowing through your house. The blood of Jesus is flowing through your house. Through your sleeping room, your bathroom, your living room. The room where there are the children, the room, the house of the dog, the place where the dogs and the cats are sleeping. The blood of Jesus is flowing through your house and through your neighborhood. And you see how the healing fire in the blood of Jesus is purifying your city. Crushing, killing, mitigating. All microbes that may cause even the smallest harm to your health. Maybe it's a little infection in a wound. Or maybe it's a big infection like AIDS. No matter what infection, it is being cleansed right now. Through the blood of Jesus. I came to cleanse the lepers. He came to cleanse the sick. If the blood of Jesus can cleanse leprosy, he can also cleanse your infections. Hallelujah. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 And pray in tongues. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. If you find it difficult to pray in tongues, simply imitate us. Hallelujah. And you see how the Holy Spirit will come and pray with you. Even as you imitate us. Hallelujah. 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 Hallelujah.
See the blood of Jesus flowing from his body in the Eucharist. Hallelujah. See the blood of Jesus flowing. Thank you, Jesus. Praise you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. 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 Now see how the blood of Jesus is flowing through every hospital you know. Hallelujah. We thank and we praise you, Jesus, that you let your blood flow, Lord, through every hospital, Lord. We thank and we praise you, Jesus, that you're letting your blood flow through the intensive care unit, Lord Jesus, of our local hospitals, Lord Jesus, of all hospitals in Croatia, in Germany, in France, in Spain, in Portugal in Austria, in, in Poland, in the Slovak and Czech Republic. Thank you, Lord Jesus, that you're letting your blood flow through all the hospitals in Europe, Lord Jesus, especially through the intensive care units. Lord Jesus, we thank and we praise you, Lord, that you're letting your blood flow through the hospitals in Great Britain, in Italy, Lord. Hallelujah, hallelujah, through all the intensive care units, Lord Jesus, hallelujah. We see how your blood is flowing now, hallelujah, through the hospitals and all the intensive care Amen. units and every patient through the hands of the doctors through the infusions lord jesus through the medicines lord jesus Amen. it is flowing Amen. through the respiration through the ventilators lord we thank and we praise you lord jesus that right now this very moment you're crushing corona in europe lord jesus we bring to you all the hospitals lord in asia lord in china lord jesus in india lord we bring to you in all the hospitals in the Ukraine, in Russia, Lord, in Singapore, in Vietnam, in, in North and South Korea, right now, let your sacred blood flow through them, Lord. We thank and we praise you, Lord Jesus, that you're bathing, drenching every hospital, every ICU, every plaster, Lord Jesus, everything, Lord Jesus, that is used in this hospital, every needle, every injection in your sacred blood, and that you're sterilizing these hospitals and these ICU units through the power of your mighty blood. We thank and we praise you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father, for the power of your blood flowing through all the hospitals in Australia, Lord, in Africa, Lord Jesus. <laughs> Lord Jesus, we bring to you the hospitals in North America and South America. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. In Greenland, Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. We bring to you all the hospitals, Lord Jesus, all over the world. And all the ICU units, Lord Jesus, and we thank you, Lord, for the miracles that you are doing right now in these instances through your sacred, mighty, holy blood that you, the Lamb of God, shed for us on the cross this Easter, Lord. We thank you and we praise you, Lord Jesus. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah. We bring to you, Lord Jesus, especially the people who we know to be sick, Lord Jesus, who have told us their names, Lord Jesus, who, who are suffering right now in the name of Jesus. In your name, Lord Jesus, we claim healing for them, Lord. We thank you, Lord, that you have healed them now, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Lord Jesus. We are your church. We are your people. We are your body. We are your representatives here on earth, Lord Jesus. We are your vicars, Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Praise you, Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Thank you, Lord Jesus, for the triumph of your blood over Corona throughout the entire world. We bring to you the people, Lord Jesus, who have no hospital. They are pure. 
the poor, Lord Jesus, but they cannot be treated in the hospital, Lord Jesus. They don't have any money, Lord Jesus. There are no hospitals for them, Lord Jesus. They have been sent home. Because there is no place in the hospital, Lord. There are so many people in Africa who are sick, Lord Jesus. But we do not see the numbers because they cannot even afford to make the test. They don't have enough number, enough money to make a test. So they cannot confirm if they have a sickness, if they don't have a sickness, Lord Jesus. Lord, we bring to you all the African sick who are dying on the streets, Lord Jesus. Right now, we pray that you flood them, that you flush them, Lord Jesus, with your sacred blood. Right now, let your sacred blood flow through every single person who has any kind of contact with the coronavirus. Lord Jesus, let your blood flow through each and every single viral particle, through every single particle of RNA and of viral protein right now. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus, for, for dissolving corona right now upon the earth. Thank you, Lord Jesus, for allowing us to be triumphant over corona through your blood lord jesus thank you lord jesus amen hallelujah amen hallelujah 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 thank you lord jesus hallelujah hallelujah we claim victory from corona lord hallelujah hallelujah thank you lord praise you jesus thank you jesus hallelujah 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 we bring to you lord jesus the doctors lord we bring to you all the doctors that are studying now to defeat corona all the doctors that are fighting all the nurses all the therapists Jesus, lord we bring to you the scientists lord Jesus. we bring to you the the global health apparatus the global health system lord you see lord Jesus, our capacities lord the same way you multiplied the bread lord Jesus. we pray that you multiply our capacities now bless the capacities lord Jesus. let us share the capacities that they may be enough for everyone lord Thank you, Jesus. Praise you, Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Bathe, Lord Jesus, our health system, Lord, in your sacred blood. Sanctify it and bless it and empower it, Lord. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Jesus. 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 Thank you, Lord Jesus. Praise you, Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah.
as you feel right now the power of Jesus flowing through you, the power of the blood of Christ, as you believe in his death and his resurrection, so believe also that the power of the blood of Jesus is flowing through each and single and everyone who you pray for, through all the hosts for have hope. And we have love that Jesus right now is fulfilling his promise. He's fulfilling his promise and has set in us and our brethren free of all sicknesses and diseases, especially making us triumphant over the coronavirus. Right now, you can bring all your sicknesses, all your worries, all your troubles into the body and blood of Christ and the Holy Eucharist. Thank you, Jesus. Praise, Praise you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Maybe you have financial worries. Hallelujah. And bring them right now into the blood of Jesus. Hallelujah. We, the church, are bringing your financial worries right now into the Blood, the body and blood of Jesus in the Eucharist. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You can bring the global economy right now into the body of Jesus. We, the church, together, we believe that the global economy is going into the body of Jesus now in the Holy Eucharist. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Praise you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord, Jesus, for this moment of faith and hope and love, Lord Jesus, in your church. We are your church, Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Praise you, Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Right now, Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. We bring to you all our worries. Maybe you have worries for your family, for your relationships. Bring them now into the body of Christ. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Sick people, they are praying for, they are praying for their families, they are praying for their children, for their parents, for their brothers and sisters, for their relatives. They are praying for friends or people they know. Lord, they are praying for people who are in hospitals, they are praying for doctors, nurses, for everyone who is taking care of the elderly. They are praying for people who are working on the streets like police and firemen fire workers, Praise many Jesus. people Thank who are on Jesus. duty these Hallelujah. days, Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. They're praying for politicians that they may make good and wise decisions, Lord. We're praying for people um, who are working in the in the supermarkets. We're praying for people who, who are really uh, listen to all the prayers of people online. They're praying for people who have lifelong sicknesses. They're praying for children who are sick. They're praying for um, their family members who are sick and friends who are sick. Lord, we pray that you shower your precious blood and wash all of them in your precious blood in this very moment, Lord. We bring to you all, everyone who is having a prayer or an intention, Lord. We're praying especially for people who are alone, who feel alone these days, who are alone at home or who are feeling alone, Lord, who are feeling desperate, Lord Jesus. We pray, Lord, we're bringing all of them to your sacred heart right now, Lord Jesus, and we pray that you touch them in this very moment, Lord, that you shower your blood and, and bring Thank hope you, and, and peace to those who are dying. We pray, Lord Jesus, for those who are dying right now, for, for those whose day today has come to come and encounter you, Lord Jesus, bathe them in your sacred blood. Grant them reconciliation, even if there's nobody there for them to give them a sacrament. The anointing of the sick or the vade mecum, Lord Jesus, we pray, Lord Jesus, that you grant them reconciliation with your heart, that you send them your angels, Lord Jesus, that they may be able to reconcile with you and may not be and may not go lost forever, Lord Jesus. We pray, Lord Jesus, for peace upon those who are going today, Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. Let the dead be risen. Come back to life, Lord Jesus. In these instants, Lord, we praise you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 We entrust ourselves to you, Lord Jesus. We're your children. Oh, it's you, me. I'm a 
Yes, Lord Jesus, right now, we, your church, together, we claim the blessing of indulgence promised to us by Pope Francis. We're going to pray now together. We also claim this blessing for all those that are watching at home that are praying with, our, with us now. Lord, you're not bound to time and space. So we also, and, and thousands and thousands and kilometers from now, please feel free, you who, brothers and sisters who are watching this video at home, to, to share this video with your loved ones and even with those who you don't love. Um, <clears throat> right now we pray together and uh, we accept the indulgence um, promised to us. We pray one our Father, one Hail Mary, one Glory be in the intentions of our Holy Father the Pope. Our Father, who art in, in heaven, heaven, hallowed, hallowed be thy, thy name, name, thy, thy kingdom, kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, it is now, and ever shall be, well with us. May the Lord Almighty bless us in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Thank you very much for sharing this uh, adoration with us. Have a powerful and spirit-filled day, filled with joy and love and hope and faith, and uh, hope we will be able to meet tomorrow again in adoration. Praise the Lord. Amen. Praise the Lord. We sing a last song.